where the country's newly formed government is now considering to revoke former Prime Minister Nawaz Sharif's conviction charges in corruption cases in order to offer him a chance to plead afresh before a court of law. Now, Pakistan media reports have quoted Federal Interior Minister Rana Sanaula Khan saying that both the central and the Punjab government have the powers to suspend a court verdict and give chance to the accused so that a renewed plea can be made. Sharif, who continues to remain in self-exile in London, will take the decision about his homecoming considering his health. The provisions, if brought in, would uh, bring some relief to the ruling Pakistan Muslim League Nawaz government and the party leaders. Nawaz Sharif, who was removed from power in 2017 after a decision by the Supreme Court, was convicted separately in two corruption cases in 2018. Sharif was given a 10-year prison sentence for owning property in London, but he was released two months later when the court rejected the sentences. In December 2018, he was jailed for another corruption case. This time, it was related to a family ownership of steel mills in Saudi Arabia. In both cases, he failed to provide the legal financial documents for these foreign properties. Sharif was in jail when allowed to go to London for four weeks for medical treatment, but he never came back. Now, according to reports, the current PAK government, led by his brother Shebaz Sharif, is now stepping up measures to bring Nawaz Sharif back to the country without the fear of being put in jail. Late last month, the government also issued a new passport to the former Prime Minister so that he can safely return to Pakistan. Weon is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.